So this is how you fast farming on console. Hello everybody, Elsa Farmer here. Today I'm gonna go through uh, some different stages of farming which you can do really fast. So the different fast farming I'm gonna show you today is harvesting cultivating, seeding, mowing, tethering, and windrowing. So first up is harvesting. So this guy here, the case 9240, is not that special. It's all about the header. So there is a mod in the mod hub called tool height control for harvesters. So if you download that one, it's only 39 kilobytes. It's by DD mod passion. So after you've done that, if you go into your headers, oh, this by the way will only uh, work for your normal crop headers. It won't work for corn headers, I think. Oh yeah, of course. Now, yeah, it does. Sorry, that came out uh, afterwards, but there we go. So if you go into your headers, you have your normal headers over here. And then you move over to, now you can see on the bottom screen, headers are attached to harvesters, a tool height control for harvester. So then you go, you find your normal headers again. Uh, but this time it's with the tool height control. So how this one works is it's a normal header. You start it up. Let's unfold the harvester. So on normal, uh, if you have a normal header, uh, these uh, harvesters will normally go 10 kilometers an hour. So let's start this up as normal and lower it. And then we start giving full throttle. And now you can see the speed is going up to 42, the maximum of what the harvester is doing. So now you can really fast farming with this one. Uh, the only thing you have to bear in mind is that when you're doing uh, fast farming with a harvester like this, uh, once you put the helper on, if I plus press circle now, the speed will go down to 10 kilometers an hour. That's fair enough. But when the harv uh, when the helper, let's see here now. The helper does not like this header at all. So if I press helper now and when it comes to the end of the row, he will just quit working. Yeah, now he also crashed with the uh, with the uh, Hedges there, but he don't like. You cannot use. Uh, you can of course use it if you have a really long stretch like this and put the helper on it. But then when it comes to the to the end, uh, then he will stop. So that's fast farming. Let's do a little bit fast here. Let's get the helper out of here. Now you can do your fields really fast. So there we go. That's fast farming with the harvester. 
So, moving on to the cultivator. Let's just stop this right here. Now, I haven't tried all of the cultivators. I've only tried this one. That's the big one. So, you just have to make sure that you have enough horsepower for the cultivator you have. So, with this kind of equipment, let's start up the tractor. Unfold the cultivator as normal. Like so. And if I now do as normal and take L1 and circle to lower the cultivator, let's see the maximum speed on this one is uh, 15 kilometers an hour. So let's let's see. I can barely take 13. 14, 15, but now if you lift lift up the cultivator L1 and circle and then you do the same again, you lower it by L1 and circle to lower it and then you keep L1 in, just press L1 in and you you tap the X button twice, very quick, like this, bang bang. And now it should be fast farming. Now you see the speed is up to 22, 23. This is a really big and heavy cultivator, but you can see it's pulling it with 26 kilometers an hour. Even though it's a little bit uphill here. So that's how you fast farm with a cultivator. So next thing will be... Uh, the cedar, I think. So over here. Somewhere. There you are. I got a cedar, which also is a cultivator and a fertilizer. So with this one, let's just unfold it. Now this one you will find under cedars. It's this one, Amazon Condor 15001. And the speed on this one is 18 kilometers an hour. And did I say how much horsepower it needs? 270. Yeah. The John Deere, John Deere is about 400, I think, so it should be good enough. So let's start it on a normal way. We turn on the sower and lower it, and then full speed. You see the speed is 18 kilometers an hour. So let's stop it there and lift it. So now you want to do the same as I did with the cultivator. You press L1 and lower the sower circle and then turn it on square. And then you just keep L1 in and you you tap the X button twice really fast bang you can see it hardly moved and then full speed ahead and now you see those 18 kilometers an hour are becoming 30, 31 And the same applies for this one and also the cultivator. If you, let's see here, if I put a worker on it, 
like this. Now I have 30. If I put the worker on it, it will drop down to maximum 18. So it, the fast farming does not work with the worker. So there we go. So what was next? I think I had a small. Uh, yeah, I can just show. It should also work with a smaller one. It's the same one. You do the same procedure. You press L1, turn on and lower it. And then L1 and double tap X. Bam. I haven't actually tried this one, but let's see. No, this one doesn't work. Hmm. I know it's not all equipment that it's working on. Let's try it again. You have to be really quick with a double X, you see. Uh, lower it down, turn on, and then bam. No, that's so this one does not work, apparently. So it's not all equipment that it's working on, apparently. This one is one of them. <laughs> so, there you go. That was uh, just to show you that uh, <laughs> it's not working on everything. But for the next items, I'm pretty sure they will work. And then we move over to grass work. So first thing is the mower, the Crone Big M450. Let's jump into this one, start it up. And here you want to unfold it, L1 and X. And then L1 and lower it and turn it on. Now this one, uh, the speed on this one is, let's see, the working speed is 25 kilometers an hour. So if I press full speed now, it will do 25. So let's just do a long stripper to do also some for the next phase so let's turn off the mower here maybe and let's line it up over here and it doesn't matter if it's up uphill or downhill it's more or less flat but the same here uh, so now it's lifted so it's the same procedure here L1 and turn on or lower that you can choose whatever you want to do first and then just press keep pressing L1 in and double tap X bam you see the front mower moved a little bit and then full speed ahead now it should go much faster yeah there we go now we're mowing at 43 the max speed of the mower So there we go. Which brings me on to the next phase of grass work. If you are doing hay, you need a tether. And this is a normal tether which is one of the in-game tethers. I think it's the biggest one. So it's the same procedure here. Um, turn on 
L1 and square, L1 and lower, it's circle, and now double tap on X, bam, and now, or should we try it? Ah, uh, we just go ahead and full speed straight away. Let's see how fast this will go. 34 to oh, 36. So there you go, it's tethering all the grass at 35 kilometers an hour uphill. Whoa. And also with these ones, it's not possible to hire a worker. If I press circle now and hire a worker, he will go down to 19 kilometers. So let's just tad all this by ourselves. And then we move over to the last phase of making hay or if you're windrowing your grass. Oh, I need my tractor. There we go. So, you guessed the right, it's the same procedure. Just fire it up or lower it, that's more or less the same. And then L1 double tap, or should we see how fast it's going normal? So this is the max speed, 18 kilometers. And then if I, I always stop it like this, I, I normally don't do a whole lot of fast farming. Uh, if I have a big field like this, I usually put the worker on it anyway, uh, but let's see, lower it, turn it on, bam, double tap X and then full speed ahead, and now we are wind rowing at 35 kilometers an hour, and I think the rows are pretty nice also, it's getting more or less everything. Whoa, whoa. There we go. So that's how you do fast farming. I assume that, well, most of you have seen this before, but for those of you who haven't seen this, uh, hopefully uh, this was of some kind of help for you. Uh, I assume that there's also other equipment that you can fast farm with, but uh, these are the ones I have found. So, leave a comment if you have any, if you have any tip on other equipment that you can fast farm with. And thank you for watching, and I'll see you soon. Bye bye. <music>